So, who are you? Hi, my name is Vicky and I work at the Rutherford Atom Laboratory in Oxfordshire. Brilliant. And uh, there's something here on the table. Uh, what's this? Uh, this is an iron meteorite. It's one of the oldest things that you will ever touch. It's about four and a half billion years old. Um, wow. It fell in Campo de Cielo in Argentina around about the time of the, the pyramids being built. And it's but not just uh, sort of a piece of scrap metal it's, somewhere? It's not a piece of scrap metal. Um, it is definitely um, part of a meteorite. Around about 100 tonnes of the stuff fell uh, around about 4,000 years ago. And we know uh, when it landed because it squashed a forest and we can carbonate the trees underneath. Fantastic. And you've got a few more samples down here we in have. front of you. Yes. Yeah. So if uh, you have a look at this one, it's got a beautiful pattern inside it. And now this pattern is only created um, in space. We cannot recreate the conditions for this on the Earth because this was from a molten metal core of a planet and it cooled around about one degree centigrade per million years. Wow. So with this um, uh, pattern you see is only... And, and what's it called, that pattern? It's the Widmann-Statten pattern. OK, I'll put a link in the video below about that. If you'd like to find out a bit more. Uh, and also, you've got something here from Mars, I believe, is we that right? We do, yes. So this is a very small sample of a Martian meteorite. So something big hit into Mars and sent a chunk into space, which landed on Earth and landed as a meteorite. And so do we have samples from the rovers that have come back or anything? Nothing have has come back from Mars because uh, we've never brought anything back from Mars. Wow. Um, so the only way you can get any Martian samples on Earth are from meteorites. Fantastic. And what else have you got, uh, um, got here today? Here we have a bit of lunar basalt, which came to us, so it's a bit of the moon. They came to us in the same way as the uh, uh, Martian sample. And uh, how much do these things cost? I mean, oh, is there, can you put a price on a bit of the moon? Or um, You can, because we did buy them. So okay. uh, this was this tiny little sliver of the moon uh, cost somewhere in the region about £250. OK, so fairly reasonable. Yeah, so this tiny bit of Mars was probably around about £350. Oh, wow. And this large chunk of... Uh, Metal was sort of six to seven hundred pounds. Fantastic. Well, thanks a lot for, for showing that to me. Thank welcome. you. Cheers. Uh, by the way, uh, you can also, if you're a teacher, um, borrow uh, bits of the moon uh, for school uh, from our Lunar Loan Scheme at STSC, Science and Technology Facilities Council. So, uh, a wonderful addition to your curriculum. Thank you. Cheers. <laughs>